Catherine's working hard. I guess even the strongest fighters can't neglect their training. At it again? Or is she still at it? Oh, a spectator. If you want to ogle, you ought to be a little less conspicuous. Sorry, I didn't mean anything by it. I was just passing by. I couldn't help but wonder, though. Have you been training all this time? Yes. I'm simulating prolonged combat. Fighting for a long time requires a whole different set of skills. If you can't handle it in training, you'll certainly be doomed against the real thing. I can't even imagine having what it takes to keep that up for so long. You want to be a mercenary, right? You should at least try to imagine. A brutal, protracted clash in open marshland, neither side retreating. In that situation, what will you do? Your survival depends on decisions you make in the moment. I see why you're so successful. Most importantly, don't give up. Don't start thinking about how you might lose or might die. Focus on surviving, on winning. You're right. I've been narrow-minded. I had decided, since I don't have a crest and can't use relics, that I'm powerless against someone like you. But that's wrong. I'm not helpless. Not as long as I'm breathing and on my feet. So, the first thing I'm going to do is learn how to beat you. When you're unarmed, at least. That's the spirit, Leone. Though I'm not planning on losing either, you know. Good. I hope you're ready. Because I'm going to train even harder than you. You remind me of myself when I was young. I would become so angry at my own weakness. I feel strangely nostalgic seeing that same anger in you. Uh, huh? Where'd that girl go? We start tomorrow!